Psychosomatic therapy consists of the psyche, which is your spirit, and soma, which is the body. And therapy is repairing those flow of expressions without restraint, being truly who you are. The better you understand the process of your own inner being, you start to be able to use each part of you better through gestures, through facial expressions, how you're feeling inside. For the last 10 days I've been studying uh, psychosomatic therapy and body-mind analysis, which is a way of looking at people's bodies to help them remember what's happened to them in the past and release old hurts and help them to um, heal themselves. So face reading is really interesting because it's like a snapshot of what your body is actually saying. And for me, for example, my nose goes like this. <laughs> so I have high expectations, which is completely true. We were reading faces and Herman read me, touched on, you know, a very strong nerve, I suppose. And I, we, could, we, we refer to them as releases. I guess that's, you know, what they are because I released a lot of energy, a lot of emotion about what had happened in my childhood. And that for me was the strongest release I had and, and others have had you know, strong releases on various days for them. As soon as we look at a face and understand the structure, whether it's square, rectangular, round or oval, the different shapes we are used to in daily life automatically give us the opportunity to understand how this shape will perform and express itself. Everyone told me my most prominent feature was my jaw, which is interesting. It, there was a lot of tightness in it. And since that first day, my jaw has actually changed. I think it was mainly because I'd released all the tension and responsibility that I felt like I had to carry. And probably took a step back in terms of how much I thought I had to accomplish and how much, you know, because that's all my determination and tension in my jaw. So my, my before photo, actually, I was really surprised because I thought my face was quite balanced, but my eye was, you know, droopy on the masculine side because I was mentally quite drained. And so now there's more balance and obviously there's a little bit more work to do, but that was a really good indication of seeing how we all tell a story and that can be seen in our faces um, and that can also be seen how we carry ourselves. I walked in here 10 days ago feeling um, really tense, really shut down because of stuff that was going on at home and in my work and I feel um, like a snake that's just shed its skin. I feel relaxed and happy and light, much lighter. Um, I feel like a new person. It's been a really interesting journey and I probably struggled to explain what exactly kind of occurred during these past 10 days. But I'm pretty sure that when I show my family and friends the photos of me before and after, um, that'll explain most of it anyway. <laughs> it's been challenging. Um, it's been very challenging at times. But we've just had the most supportive environment, the most supportive group of people who have all helped me in their way to achieve what I've achieved, both in terms of learning the material and learning myself. It's been an unforgettable experience.